guys. Welcome back. This is gonna be September favorites. What the heck, man? I wanna get through this pretty fast. Um, my first favorite of the month is the T25 workout system that I've started in the last week. And oh my gosh, I've already lost five pounds. My body looks completely different. It's just like the kick in the ass that I needed to get my body going in the right direction and where I want it to be. It, it makes me feel energized and confident and it's a really good way to start my day. I'm loving T25. Sean T is my new <laughs> is my new crush. When I close my eyes and I'm working out and I'm like trying not to die during the workout, I hear Will Smith in my head. I open my eyes and I look and he's got like these gorgeous eyes and he's like motivating me. I love you. I love you, Shanti. I know you're married and I know that you don't like me the way that I like you, but I still love you. That's like the story of my life. <sighs> my next favorite is um, kimchi. Yep. Kimchi. Frickin' kimchi. I went to the Asian market this week, or like two weeks ago, and bought like this big jar of kimchi because I keep putting it on everything. He keeps putting it on everything. Um, I like to use like steamed broccoli and put a little bit of salsa ranch mixed in with it and then a little bit of kimchi on top and oh my gosh, it's so good. I know that's a really weird favorite to have, but I like kimchi. <laughs> my next kind of weird, um, nerdy favorite would have to be my new Lysol, um, what is it even called? Power Kitchen Cleaner. And it has kind of changed my life a little bit and I know that's a total mom thing to say, but it's true. Um, first of all, it kills 99% of bacteria, so that's good. It's like a disinfectant cleaner. Um, it decreases, it like breaks down stuff that's stuck on there, which is huge. It leaves like shine, so it's like your disinfectant, your degreaser, and your your shine cleaner all in one, which I've never had a cleaner that does all three. I'll go through like a good bottle a week. I'm just spraying it on everything. Like, watch out. Oh, my lens is dirty. I'm in love with it. Um, another thing that I've been really kind of using in my daily household work is um, this app I saw from gosh I don't even know what she's calling her channel these days I will leave her channel video link here it's this uh, home routines app it is helping me like have a daily cleaning routine which is something that I like desperately needed and um, in the last month I've really like transformed our house and reorganized and decluttered and like it doesn't even look like the same house it's consistently clean all the time now which i haven't been able to say pretty much since um since i was pregnant with her there's just a combination of things kind of working in our favor and now i kind of have have my stuff together and my house is totally more manageable we can get to the makeup because i think that's pretty much all i have left so we'll start with lipstick i did a video a swatch video on my makeup channel um, my beauty channel, Franny, Bia Fran 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 Brown <laughs> Beauty, um, for these new matte Maybelline lipsticks. Oh my gosh, they are so amazing. And um, this Lust for Blush one is my baby. I'm telling you guys, look at this. I don't know. Well, just showing you it doesn't tell you anything. But if you saw what it looked like, like how, how much I've worn it down since I've got it, you would be kind of impressed. Since it's officially fall now and... Um, you know, the whole berry lip trend is back. I have been mixing two MAC lipsticks, um, Heroin and Ho. He, Hue. He, Hue? Yeah. I'm not Rihanna, so I, these are both limited edition. I apologize. I'm really sorry. But I'm sure that you can find something similar out there. But I just really like the way that these look together. Uh, that's what I'm wearing now on my lips. Um, for eyeshadow, I've been really loving this combination of stuff. I will show you what it is. 3D Liquid Luster Drops by Lorac. Um, I like to pat that on and then actually use it underneath the, the eyeshadows that I'm about to show you. I don't know. It's my favorite way to wear eyeshadows wet is to kind of put the wet agent on a brush and then pat it on my lid and then go in and then put it on top. That's just how I like to do it. And I pulled out my Too Faced Natural Eye Palette. This was the first eye palette yeah. I ever, ever got. Like it got kind of like kickstarted my interest and obsession with beauty so I will show you mm, no and what it's fine oh can we just talk about like how much pan I've hit on this so there's these three I've hit major pan on this one's pretty close this one I used to use for my eyebrows so it's pretty close too kind of inspired me to pull this out other than the fact that it's an awesome palette it is like just the spirit of trying to kind of declutter and use up things 
that are kind of on their last leg in my makeup collection and this I'm kind of sad that I'm trying to actually like use this palette up but at the same time I feel like that's like an accomplishment in life if you don't really have goals so if you're like me you know set the bar really low finish your eyeshadow palette and then you can have the achievement unlocked and you get a high five this palette's really pretty I will show you these three they all look the same on camera so I don't know what the point of this is but honey pot is actually kind of a naughty um, a naughty name for an eyeshadow I'm pretty sure it means vagina that's kind of what they do nowadays with makeup they're like oh I'm just gonna name it like sugar walls like who you who are you trying to, to fool with that name Too Faced Gerard Blondita enough with the sexual inappropriate eyeshadow names. really enjoyed using this MAC blush in Immortal Flower. It was from their, um, their orange, they had like an orange collection last summer. The pale, um, orange blush, peachy blush that I like to blend out the crease of my eyeshadow. So I really like to use the NARS Albatross highlight as an inner corner highlight. And then, yeah, it's gorgeous. Do you guys want to see how pretty? I don't even, like, this is like the most perfect golden shimmery inner corner highlight. I don't actually really like it for a cheek highlight. It's this right here on my hand. But for an inner corner highlight, oh my gosh, it's like perfect. I did want to share a couple of fails with you guys because I do have a couple. I think my kids clothing fall haul has been uploaded yet. So yeah. Anyways, I got this shirt for Sadie for fall. And the first time I put it on her, um, I took a picture, I uploaded it to social media, and everyone's like, oh, it's so cute, love it, love it, where'd you get it? And then um, I put her in the Tula and wore her, like, just getting in, out of the, in and out of the car and around the house for errands and stuff, and the glitter on this shirt completely rubbed off on her face and her neck and all over me, and I was like, what the hell is going on with this? I just got glitter bombed by this shirt, and I was all worried that it was going to get in her eyes, and so I washed it, and then, <laughs> as you can see, it just, com just completely, like, just rubbed off. So, um, don't ignore me, children's place. Don't do that. It's not cool. And then my other fail is uh, Highlands Teething Tablets, which is crazy because I have sworn by these for years. I recommend them to everybody. And for whatever reason, these are just not working out for us. They're not helping Sadie the way that they helped Jax. He cut most of his teeth before the recall in 2011, I want to say, 2010 or 2011. So they recalled these, they changed the formula, um, re-released them. So this is the new, this is the new stuff Sadie's getting and Jack got the old stuff, which worked so well. Yeah, I just don't like seeing my baby in pain. It sucks. I don't like it. So those are my favorites for the month of September. I'm showing my T25 abs when I get my T25 abs. I just don't have them yet. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure, oh yep, yeah, all the juices. Mm -hmm. Anyways, bye guys.